New at 10, is arming police with body cameras the right move for Madison? It's a question city leaders are struggling with. NBC 15 Zach Nugent joins us to explain. Lee, this discussion is far from over. Tonight, the Board of Estimates did approve to send a resolution to the City Council calling for $30,000 to study body cameras, but they did so with some hesitation. It would be a pricey undertaking to arm 335 Madison patrol officers with body cams. And Police Chief Mike Koval is worried about that $900,000 cost and its impact. Do you want to put it in technology or do you want to put it into more boots on the ground creating relationships? I'm concerned that the cameras may be over promising to over expectations because just because we're recording a lot of stuff again does it get at the root core or cause of the problems between police encounters with our citizens. Chief Koval isn't alone. I'm concerned that looking at this, this doesn't change anything. So what is the answer to providing more transparency and improving community interactions with police? If we need change, it needs to happen on the relationship level. It needs to happen on an attitude and a value level. And we need our community to voice their opinion on it. Many at tonight's Board of Estimates meeting have plenty of doubts on the idea of body cams. Because the, the use of body cameras by a police force is a shift. And maybe Madison is ready for that shift and maybe Madison isn't. But they're willing to possibly spend money on research. The board sent a study proposal to the city council that includes the help of the community and an outside project manager. That means, for now, the issue Chief Koval admits is getting a lot of attention will stick around. I think there's a greater impetus now in light of a post-Ferguson world. I think that, that it's becoming sort of the new flavor of the month for my industry. Now, if this measure passes the council, the mayor will be tasked to hire an outside project manager by March 2nd. But Alder Subek did look to ensure that as of now, it's not the foregone conclusion that Madison police will be getting body cams.